pair here has a black one, a female. He's right here. Yeah, that's Mulan, the most obedient Mulan. dog of them all. <laughs> yeah, do you want to explain why that is? Yeah, my dog is uh, a lot higher level than the other dogs here, so it will follow commands a lot better. So it gets, gains experience after you use it, so it gets more obedient over time. Yes, and that is pretty much uh, a very good piece of information because the dogs here will have a skill level. So let's see. Um, I'm I'm just going into the inventory to show you something. Uh, as you can see, my dog here he has a a green collar. Yeah, Duke, huh? How are you? Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. Yeah. So I go to the inventory and um, I just have here an extra slot for my dog. It's next to clothing. Just to show you guys. And here I have already some different colors for the colors. Uh, I have currently the, the green one, but I would like to have the orange one. So I'm just going to change that. And give an individual name to your dog, which is really cool, I think. And I don't know, but um, I think, Pear, it's a bit fast to read all the questions, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can try to just uh, take some out there. So one good thing that I saw, it's about how you level the dog. And you level the dog by performing commands with it. So for each command it successfully does, uh, it will uh, give them some point of experience to gain to the next level. And for each level, you unlock something new for the dog. Yeah, so um, this sounds like a pretty deep gameplay, so to speak. There, yeah, there are quite a lot of skills right now. Maybe it's something that we can show off later. I think we're having 12 separate skills right now for the dog that improves okay. him in different things. I see. If you want, I can show them the skill um, sheet for your dog, so you can, in the meantime, um, tell them a little bit about this. Um, yeah, the different skills. I think it's a good time to do that. Yeah, let's start with that right away. So as you can see here, this is the dog of Pear, and um, you see here in the. Statistics page, it has its own page. Uh, I think this could be very interesting for you guys to see because um, if I'm hovering over the icons here, you can see all of these are different skills that your dog will have at some point of yeah, the journey of leveling up. Um, let's pick one out. This one, for example, is follow owner. And this skill governs how well a dog can stay close to its owner. So, yeah, or for example, this one. This skill is loyalty, and it governs how well a dog follows a command. It's uh, It affects all other commands in the game. So here you can see it's quite deep with 12 um, different skills that you can level and yeah and each skill can uh, level separately into different amount of levels so some of them are set to six and some of them are set to three yeah as you can see here for example the follow stance the skill governs how well a dog can follow in owner's stance that has six steps uh, whilst this soft mouth um, with this skill um, it, yeah, uh, that lets the dog either damage or not damage the fetched bird. I think that's uh, important for the for the integrity of the trophy, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so you can see it's quite a lot of stuff to uh, to um, discover. So I'm not going into detail with it because you guys want to discover some of your own, I guess. So Ron, are we uh, ready to? Uh, to join your game again. All right. Uh, 
and uh, I see that people are asking about the level, seeing how many it is. There is uh, no more than 50. 50 is the maximum level. So that's how far you can get with it. Yeah, that's the developer dog. <laughs> the dogs of uh, Ron, McTube and myself are at level 1. So it's a huge difference, of course, how well the dog um, yeah, responds to the commands, but that's also the depth in it that you will have to make an effort in order to get a perfect dog. <laughs> yeah, just like in real life, it takes time to get the dog obedient and good. Exactly. Uh, I've already seen a lot of uh, questions about the cost. The price isn't really finalized yet. And it won't be for free, but it won't be as expensive as many have thought about. I mean, we won't go to $50 or something like that crazy. Okay, that's nice to hear. So, um, here we are all together again. And... Um, where is the black dog? It's right next to me. I see a blonde, uh, a yellow one. Yeah, for ah, me yeah. That, that one is yellow. <laughs> that is uh, one of the bugs that are still left in the game. Okay. You can't see the wrong color of it. All right, so now we can go into um, giving commands to the dog. I think that's something I have to, to show from my screen. So for all you guys out there, the brown one is my dog called Duke. So let's try to bring him here. So I'm pressing uh, a key. It's Y on my keyboard. And here you can see a pie menu popping up uh, with all the different commands that you can give to the dog. Um, I think for now, I want it to come here. So. could see on the left side he heard it but you know he's not not reacting so well there he is and now let's try to make him sit for us could be quite hard at the low level but he's doing it <laughs> tell him stay and he's staying good dog ah you're doing so well duke Something worth mentioning there, you can see in the bottom left whether or not he understands and responds to the command. So if he fails, you will get a, a small GUI element to tell you that something yeah. went wrong. So now I told him stay. Let's see how well that works. I'm just going backwards now, away from him. Yes, stay, Duke. Good dog. And now let's try if I can bring him towards me and uh, remember we are still at level one with Duke so it might not go perfect see there was a question mark now on the on the uh, lower left side so he didn't quite understand what I was asking him still not sure <laughs> and still not sure <laughs> now he got it Come here. Good dog. And you can see now here with Duke in the spotting. Let's try to sit him down again. And he does. Good boy. Now this time he didn't get it. Ah, that's better. So you can see here at the experience, if I go on him again, he's gaining his experience. So he's at 19.7. And he requires to be on 46 in order to reach the next level. Maybe, uh, Pear, you can tell us something about the refresh thing. It's about uh, what kind of stamina the dogs have right now. So a dog that has a lot of stamina will gain more XP from doing commands. And a dog that is very tired will get, gain less stamina. If the dog would happen to lose all his stamina, he won't uh, do any commands for a while. But he does constantly regain stamina while it's not being used. 
Okay, so only giving commands to him will take away from his freshness. Is that correct? Exactly. Exactly. So you can walk okay. around with him without losing the stamina. So actually, actually, by taking him on a walk, he will gain stamina, kind of, as long as I'm not asking him to sit every five minutes. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Okay. So right, maybe um, Ron, you could also show us some stuff, maybe with uh, with sausage. You can see here he's a. That, that must be sausage. It's a male yellow retriever. And I think Ron is giving some commands at the moment. So here you can see it compared on my screen. The left one is the female um, yellow retriever. And here is the male. You can see the difference. It's pretty nice. Not only by the pink color. <laughs> All right, so let's see if uh, Duke also wants to join us here. Oh, he's not understanding. Now he is. Come here, Duke. Good doggy. <laughs> oh, this feels so cool. Sit down, Duke. Oh. Sit. Yeah, that's a good dog. And stay. Didn't get it again. Day. Good one. All right. I think we just covered the basic um, functionality. But now, guys, I think it's time to take him out hunting. Isn't it? Yeah, maybe you could, you could show how it's um, possible to work with the dog and with a blind. Yeah. Just go to your blind and, and demonstrate it, kind of. I will follow you. Hey, Duke, no barking. That's not nice. <laughs> so Ron is now trying to tell Sausage to get in the blind with him. But he's not he's not reacting so far. No. And there he is. So it's possible to uh, have the dog in the blind and uh, we hopefully will be able to do that with uh, with Duke as well now. Come on, Duke. Let's take this blind. Okay, so I'm going into the blind. Come on, Duke. Oh, that was the wrong command. Come on. See, as long as you see the question mark, he didn't know what I was trying to ask him. So now I told him sit and stay. Yeah, stay, Duke. Please stay. And Duke has reached level two. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. Oh, good that you didn't understand that one. That was the wrong one. Now he understood. Good boy. All right. I think I'm ready for some duck hunting. Oh. If Duke would behave, that is. Let's up. So hopefully we can soon see the retrievers in action. Breaking. Yeah, they are breaking. Excellent. Come on, guys. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, run, just use start, yeah. Oh, nice! <laughs> Every single one. Bam! That was good. Okay, so let's... Um, should we all start at once? Well, let's, let's start with Ron. Maybe Sausage wants to retrieve something. Oh, there we go. Yeah! Sausage has something, and he's putting it down, just there for Ron. Nice. Okay, I'm shooting from the back of the flock, so Ron, you can take the first ones. Alright, awesome. <laughs> Bam! <laughs> Did everyone get some? I'm um, pretty sure I got one. See if she catches something there. There she goes. Ah, that is mine. Oh, nice. Good girl. <laughs> He's doing so well. Come on, Duke. Let's get out. All right. I think that should be an easy one for you. Oh, he's not really reacting. Sausage is doing well, though. I think he might be too uh, tired. So what level of uh, stamina does he he's, have now? He's winded at 100%. Oh, that's fine. He should be able to get he something still. Okay. Because when I'm uh, trying, uh, when I'm asking him to fetch, he's not reacting. Yeah, doesn't seem to want to be yeah. obedient right now. Yeah, you had a you had a hard working day. You did a lot. Yeah, you're a good boy anyway. <laughs> uh, it almost looked like Smulan tried to teach your dog how to get it. Yeah, leave it in front of him. <laughs> So let's watch uh, Spurlan a bit. Uh, that wasn't mine though. Yeah, that was mine. Go girl. If I got them one more. I'm pretty sure that wasn't mine either. Ah, oh, Ron is making a trophy shot at the moment. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Look how nice Run and sausage The one to the right as well You should flush him first Yeah, that's true, that's very true Get too scared to fail <laughs> nice run! <laughs> oh, you got the flying one? <laughs> yeah. Wow, nice. No. Ah, oh, come on. But that's the first one you can, uh, you can have. Yeah, I'm gonna get that as well. I'm just too bad for that. Let's take the one I got on the ground. So I'm uh, fetching it right now. 
<laughs> I shot one behind me too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me watch it. Here she goes. Nice. And she's retrieving it. Um, Steve, no, that was the uh, 20 gauge semi automatic uh, with the carbon look. Here she can sit down with the bird, so I'm going to try to take a. Ron is a pure god. 